when you and I, we walk down the street and, and there's recognitions, you know, from within the community, yeah. people are instantly saying, holy shit, this is like a destiny moment. You're, you're here for a boot camp. I'm in. Yeah. Right? yeah. And that's yeah. how we get Literally, yeah. quite a few we, of the, uh, we've got the more people get. walking around than right. they did just like putting data. Yeah, so why, why do I even bother reaching out online? It's because these guys around the world are into it. They've been fascinated by the pickup culture for many years. And what am I trying to do here? I'm trying to put a fire under your ass and say, get on a plane. All you need to do is get a flight, know when the boot camp is, sign up, and get a nearby hotel. That's exactly. it. Exactly. Simple. The whole point is to get everyone into one room so that for three days and three nights, we can deliver the goods. We can traumatize your brain, get it bruised so that you can recover when you go back home three days, four days later and bring your skill set back with you. Perhaps you have never been to either. Maybe you'd like to know someone on the ground when you get there. Certainly, whenever you go to a new city, you're going to want to meet the women there. In fact, that's kind of a reason to go. Why do people gaggle together and go to Vegas? They go, yeah, sure, for the gambling, but also because they may meet somebody. They may have some fun, right? They get out of their own boring lives and they get to assume the life of someone who travels, right? A world traveler. We're going to be meeting women. Lots and lots of women. How many sets does a typical student endure? Over a boot camp. Over a boot camp. Anything from 50 to 350. That's my... That's okay. how I sort of yep, see fair, it. Fair enough. Because some are just... Some just need They know they got to flood it. They know they got to go in. And we can give immediate feedback. I'll say, I, I like to say at least a dozen sets a night. Yeah. Right? If you yeah. do 12 sets a night, now you've got a learning curve. Because the first three sets are going to be your warm-ups. The last three sets are going to be way better than your first three. Right? Now, that's just day one. So on day two, when you do that all over again, kind of like Groundhog Day, except for one little fact... Last night's successes will assist you in this night's successes. Even when it comes to the failures, you'll learn what not to do so that the pathway of what you should have done will reveal itself for the next day. And so after three days, your brain will become bruised. You will actually traumatize yourself. And why is it that people always want us to go to their city? Like, do you want to in your backyard? You're going to have to fuck up some sets, brother. So why not? up somewhere where it's a big city where it's just fun and, and, and glorious uh, uh, social interaction you get that beautiful sound of the chat you know it sounds so right and so within the context of of a different environment if you uh, wreck a set who cares who's gonna remember the next day you know you're allowed to break some eggs uh, you're allowed to ruffle some feathers Everybody is... You and know, you, that's how you learn by that's ruffling how you, feathers. That's how you learn. That's how you get under someone's skin, right? That's how you infuse into their spirit. Like Evoke something. Incense. Right now, I'm going through a rather large list of people who are interested in taking a boot camp with us. It's what I would call data overwhelm. Generally speaking, we fill our boot camps by word of mouth. So I've done a lot less online marketing than some of the other guys. And here's why. There's a touch the hem principle or touch the hem uh, phenomenon that sort of takes place. When someone recognizes mystery in their city, they flip the f out and they take the boot camp that weekend. That's how it works. So we always fill. So what do I do with all these guys that I've actually engaged in interaction with them online? You know, we, we all have comments on each other's posts and, uh, and lots of laughs. Do give Robert Beck, that's Bexter, a contact through Facebook. That's your compliance test. And in return for doing that, he'll send you these dates. And some videos. Uh, oh yeah. yeah, and some of our infield. We made a video. Our, some, uh, some of our private infield footage. So there you have it, those are the dates. And I'd like to extend an invite out to you as well. This is a relatively private video message to you. Anything else we want to add? Uh, just that, if you get in touch with me, we can give you a lot more info on that. But the thing is... What info, what info exactly? Where to get an Airbnb near us? The whole point of getting an airplane ticket is just, just to get everybody in the same space. 